Happy Wednesday, everyone. It's time for our trip to the new zoo. Neil Anderson joins us this morning from Swamico. Hey, Neil, how you doing? Pretty good. You know, although it's getting colder out, you know, the zoo's going to be open year-round. And you might think these guys behind me, the snow monkeys, and they're coming out right now, they're letting them all out, that these guys, you know, it'd be too cold for them. But they're actually the northernmost primate in the world. You know, they live on the islands of Japan, and we've got 13 here. And you can see they're all coming out. You can see the little ones coming out. Now, they, we've got two little ones in here that just, one's going to turn six months old tomorrow, and the other one's about uh, almost seven months old. And they're doing real well, you know, working into the troop. And that's something you remember, you know, uh, Jessica, our zookeeper, you know, I had worked with them and hand raised them. Um, and what happened here is, uh, well, I should say her and Shannon did. Uh, they've got them back in here. Now, they haven't had any really contact with them taking them out of this group in the back area. Now they're officially in the group. But you know what's interesting with these two little ones? They switch moms. Oh, so, right. One, yeah, so they ended up switching moms. Now, one of them's going to benefit from that because in the, in the snow uh, macaque, in their social structure, what happens there is that uh, depending on, you know, the rank uh, of the males and the females in here will determine the rank then of the little ones as well. Now, you can see also we've put some enrichment out. And uh, enrichment, we've got actually they put some gourds out here. Uh, that actually are looking like uh, snakes out here. So see if they enjoy that to move around. And you can see everybody kind of takes their place out here in the morning. This is their morning ritual. They come out after the zookeepers do their cleaning. You know, we've kind of winterized this exhibit. You know, there was a pond there. You see they're kind of climbing in around that area. So we winterized that. But you see everybody sits in their spot. And you see there's, there's the big uh, leader. There's the big male sitting up. He's got the tallest rock up there. How okay, cool. but you know, and I'll tell you how strong these guys are. A male that size is as strong as a man. Huh. And nobody, none of the other um, macaques will go. Oh, well, that one was brave. Yeah, yeah, they'll <laughs> go ahead now. Yeah, they'll go ahead. You know, and they'll take uh, take their own places. On you know, that's one thing when we set this exhibit up too, because you know it's open. You know, throughout the winter, and they'll be out here. I mean, they can go in at 65 degrees if they want. You know, He's rattling some cages there. <laughs> yeah, he's just letting hey, everybody know was, who's the Somebody boss got close to me when I was up on my high rock. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's probably what he said, too. <laughs> but, yeah, they'll go ahead. You know, they'll be hanging out. It'll be, you know, like I said, it'll be cold. It'll be below zero. And they can go inside at 65 degrees in there. And what they'll actually do is, you know, they'll spend a lot of time outside. You know, that was one of the things we did the exhibit and positioning where the rocks are. So that you can pick up uh, the uh, the south, uh, they face the south and southwest. So those rocks kind of heat up through the day, and uh, they like to sit out there in the afternoon. But you can take a look. Here's the range of where they're found in Japan. Now, as you as they get further north, you know, on the island of Japan. Now, the further most part of Japan, they're not found, but they're smaller down here. And as they get up north, they get larger. And the reason that being is when you have that large body mass compared to the surface area of the skin, yeah, it's better as far as keeping, you know, the uh, heat within your body and everything. So they we, get we several adaptations. Mm -hmm. We know that here in the <laughs> winter time. We I got know. a we lot of extra practice skin. That. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Yep. Thanks for the reminder. <laughs> Thanks, Neil. We'll check Sounds back good. in the next hour, okay? Hey, we'll see ya.